spray or not to spray for sclerotinia stem rod of canola? That's a tough question. Every year we ask whether or not we should be spraying for this disease, and in reality we don't need very much infection to justify a fungicide application on a 50 bushel canola crop. Roughly 10% infection is equal to the cost of a fungicide. How do you know if you are going to have more than 10% infection is the, the tough question, I guess. You basically need to know two things then, if the environmental conditions are right and if you have the pathogen present. Sclerotinia likes wet conditions. 80% uh, relative humidity in the canopy during flowering and, and afterwards seems to be the minimum threshold for the disease. So the longer it is wet in the canopy, the more disease that we often see. How do we know if the pathogen is present? Well, in wet years, it is usually pretty safe to assume that the pathogen will be present, but you can verify that with a sclerotinia stem rot DNA test, and that will help you determine if the pathogen is there as well. Mm -hmm.